Hey guys, Jim from Azure Square here. Welcome to part two of the product assignment tutorials in the Getting Started series for Azure Square 8. In this video, we will cover assigning a tile pattern to a room. As you can see from my diagram, I already have some product added, but I have this white space that I have sectioned off for my tile product using the divider tool. Our first step is to select the tile pattern we wish to add. To do this, we will go into our Tile Patterns menu on the left side of our screen. From here, you will see the list of choices I have for my tile patterns. For this example, we are going to use our Tile Offset. To add this tile pattern to our selected area, I'm going to left click and hold and begin to drag it over onto the diagram. As I do this, the Assign Tile Pattern menu will appear. Once I'm ready to add the tile to this pattern, I will select the drop down menu. From here, you'll see the 6x12 tile that I have created. An important note to make, the only tiles that will appear are the ones that can fit within this tile pattern. So I will select Dal Tile 6x12. I will then select OK at the bottom of the screen. Now you'll see that upside down A showing that we have a product selected on our mouse. As I hover over each individual room or area, it will highlight accordingly. When I left click within a room, you will now see that tile pattern added with the 3x6 tile I inserted. In the next video, we will cover adding a flash cove to a room and adding a flash cove to multiple rooms.